Well, thank you, sir. Oh, that's nice. He's taking a right in front of me. Oh, that's perfect. I'm Natalie. Yeah. I am, uh, uh-uh. I'm Natalie, and I am the baddest, baddest, baddest bitch to ever enter marriage boot camp. And this is Jacob, my husband. Yep. I'm Jacob, and I'm a professional arena football player. Don't talk. OK. Yes, just what a bad girl needs. Our marriage is in trouble because Natalie still acts like she's living in the bad girl house. And her ass is all over the internet. It deserves to have its own page. We are always fighting over what the public is saying. What is there good to say about you? Cheers. Yes. Wow. We need to step our game up. I need a house like this. Well, we might not leave then. <laughs> Right? The house was so big, it just reminds me why I want to keep on posting my ass on Instagram and make this money. We're the first ones in here right now. I know, like, we it's like to house. make ourselves at home, but I'm just telling you right now. Walk around the house with your shirt off. And I know you like to cook, but don't do that. It is a jacuzzi out there, though. And I don't think you'll be taking your clothes off to get in it, though. <laughs> I choose not to walk around with my shirt off because I'm married. No. I don't need to be. Jacob knows not to take his shirt off because his wife is crazy. And if a bitch even remotely looks his way, I'm going to snatch the bitch up. There you go. Let's greet our other couples and act like we have some damn sense while we're here. Housewives. Yes. OK. Yes. Yes. All right. OK. Yes. Just click. I knew exactly who Aviva was. I've seen the messy ass housewives. They're like 40 year old bad girls still trying to hold on to a leg and be bad. I was originally on the Bad Girls Club show. Oh, okay. uh -huh. And then we got married on Bright oh, Yeah. Oh, uh -huh. fun. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Which one were you on? Bad Girls Club. I've never seen you. Bitch. Selena, you know who I am. Bitch one and bitch two going at it, it's gonna be a bitch fight. The party is over. No more fun. We have to start this whole marriage boot camp with a lie detector test. The very first day, we digging deep. And I'm ready to f Jim and Elizabeth up. Do you hide things in your personal life from Jacob? No. Exception indicated. Do you use your fame to get stuff for free? No. Yes. Deception indicated. Would you give up your career for Jacob? Yes. We're not going to reveal. We will give you the truth at the end of the boot camp. Do you trust Natalie? Yes. Deception indicated. Have you ever thought of leaving Natalie? Yes. No deception indicated. Natalie, game changer question. If I don't stop doing reality television, will you leave me? No. We will reveal the answer at the end of the boot camp. Oh, <laughs> Are you mad? This is very conceited. Natalie. Ass Natalie. Natalie. Pictures. Natalie. All over the it's room. It's heaven for you, huh? It's hell for me. All of these pictures that are all over the room were the pictures that Jacob does not like me to post on social media sites. And he immediately has this look in his eyes where he is like disgusted. What's that picture for? Just showed that my butt looked like a heart. This is not me. Like, this is me for my work. What's that picture for? Riding on the beach. Horseback riding. What is the problem? Were well, you gonna pull your panties up just so you can get a better picture of your ass? I pull my panties up. That was the cut of the bikini. What is the problem? I didn't like waking up this morning. I didn't like seeing Natalie's ass everywhere. You're being team hater. I'm being team photo album to show the kids later. <laughs> <laughs> so if you wanted to rain money, can I shake my ass? If you want to act like a stripper, <laughs> and you could be a stripper then. The minute I saw Judge Toller, I knew that she was a bitch. Court for bad girls is nothing new, so. <sighs> so. All she's concerned about is what she can do for her career. He's always trying to slow somebody down, Your Honor. All he wants me to do is sit in the house, pop out a bunch of babies, put an apron on, and cook. I think you're confusing loud and angry with strength. 
I think you're scared to death. You gotta put up a whole lot of crash, boom, and bang because you're really not quite sure what your worth is. Girl. Don't call me girl. What my worth is? Okay, let me explain something to you. With or without Jacob, I'm gonna be good. I mean, we come from two completely different places on the map. This man and he can bop out your house tomorrow and have women 35 deep waiting on him. Trust that. I just don't think he's going anywhere. So you don't think he has options? Not better than this. OK. I can't talk to her. It might be a good thing that you don't have children with her. Hey, bitch, shut the hell up before I come across this damn podium and smack you in your face. There will be no recovery. I'm being nice. You don't want to see me start coming out because I don't have any fear. So I'm just giving everyone a heads up now that I can't make any promises that I'm not going to act a fool in this house. You're just trying to pin me down. You need to slow down. <laughs> well, having kids doesn't mean that I just need to slow down. I don't need to just stop. What does that mean, then? No, the family issue is not going to resolve me just slowing down. Well, your no, family isn't 100% fond of me either. Your family started with all the drama in the first place, Jacob. There was no family drama until your family came in and started t attacking me, saying, oh, she's bad. That Rude. You're always trying to blame me for everything. Oh, she's the bad girl. So let's go all the balls. You're not over a here. bad girl. Get over in your circle. Do all mine. Bye. Listen, go. You don't have no, to put your hands there. on. No, seriously, listen, go over listen. there. Go over there. Relax. No, I'm not. You don't don't, don't put, do don't that. Don't put your hands on. Don't me. do that. Those are yours. You wouldn't put your hands on me at home. Don't put your hands on me here. Do it. That, that's all right. It. Here we go. Throw your One. ass in the lake. One. Okay. One. I'm gonna knock this whole. Over. That's what I'm gonna do. You make me so mad that I possibly can end up in jail. We'll probably be in divorce court and I'll be slapping the out of the judge. That's it. You're done. This is not going to be good. Natalie should never have a gun in her hand. God. Want me to step in front of all the bullets for you? I'm thinking this is going to be fun to shoot people. I'm kind of excited. You're really messed up in the head. <laughs> Do not hit me. I'm gunning for the leg. <laughs> Who got me in the face? Oh my god, somebody got my leg. <laughs> I shot Tyson because I just think that she has given you quality time. She gave you six years. Natalie's definitely gonna get a shot more. Lies. Natalie, I shot at you. Natalie, I shot you. What? Bitch, we're supposed to be on the same team. Rachel, can we do that over again? Because I'm coming for Rachel then. I just want to know why Rachel decided that she thought it was OK to shoot me with her paintball gun after all that I have done for her. Like, bitch, are you crazy? I think it's natural that that makes him feel uncomfortable. Maybe there's an alternative, since it bothers him. Put so on much. a one piece so I can look like a <laughs> housewife? A nice That's not going to work. I'm definitely not pre the preacher's wife. My image is the bad girl. I'm pissed. Bitch, you're running the streets until 5 o'clock in the morning. You're probably around on Tyson, but I'm still on your side. Like, straight up. Bitch, I'm, com I'm coming for you. I'm about to turn this house upside down. Natalie is really starting to get to me. This is not Bad Girls Club anymore. We're supposed to be worried about our problem. I'm just going to call it how I see it. I think you're being a fake as I continuously stick up for you, Rachel. And today, you shot me, and it was like a slap in the face. You need to realize that I thought that was fake. You could have just not shot at either one of us. Why are you using the word fake? Well, that was my opinion. Because it's You know that, too. I stand up for you and I say all the time. And then now you want to sit up here and you want to act like you're so peaches and cream and a sweetheart. Doing at 5 o'clock in the morning in the streets for. I'm just going to keep it all the way 100 because I feel like when you guys come in the room, I have to be so sweet all the time. So are you being fake with us? I'm not being fake. I'm just going to keep it 100 for today. I called Rachel a fake ass bitch because I feel like she's fake as f I have been nothing Give but nice Give me a nice situation because fake isn't the no, right it's word. So, no, fake meaning that I have been nothing but giving you a little bit of like, um, and you shot me. Mm -hmm. So since you want to keep on being a smart ass like you did at the table, let me do an exercise. Nelly. 
I'm gonna move. You want me to keep it 100, Rachel? Let me keep it 100. Let Natalie I'm not, I don't wanna let say. you know how I feel. I feel like you robbed me from my experience today shooting the gun. Here's my exercise. So that right there is me shooting you with the paintball gun today, okay? Nelly. Now we can go back to the Nelly. evaluation. Now we can proceed. Oh, there it is. Go to your room. There it is, sweetheart. This is why we're here. I need to post a picture on Instagram. She's she's tweaking at this point. I'm just gonna go like that. How is this showing the dress? Right here. You, you can can't see stand it. up and show it from the side. Just take the picture, Jacob. Take the picture. I took a picture already. Take one more. And I'm tell me, count one more. like you're supposed one, to. Thank you. Two, three. Jacob is doing a horrible job on purpose. At this point, you need to do one, two, three, fearless. One, two, three, beautiful. You're just literally, don't do that. What are you doing? That's not, that's not why we're here. No, do one more. Like stand this. up. Jacob, I'm serious, I swear to God, don't if do that. If you stand up, I'll take the picture for you. I'm not standing up. You're letting Jim and Elizabeth, you're letting their little them. program I've always said get me more this. mad. I've said before we got here about these pictures, all of them. They're trying to change you, and I married you for you because you were on Team Natalie. Now I you're on Team am. Marriage Boot Camp Let's trying stop. to run my life. It's exactly what they're doing. Let's stop. Respect. That's the main thing that you should have in a marriage, and that's the main thing we're here fighting for. Yeah, you. We see his chest, Natalie. You better not be looking. <laughs> <laughs> you're going to be going on a date. What? The best person for Jim and Elizabeth to what? pair me up with right now would be God himself. That's the only person you're allowed to go on a date with. The only person that can save me right now. Natalie and Spencer, <laughs> you two are going to get physical as you learn jujitsu. I have no idea really what jujitsu is, but I know it's fighting and kicking ass, so I'm game. I can't stand that Natalie's going on a date right now. More, right there. I don't want to have to whoop nobody's ass tonight for getting too touchy feeling. <laughs> okay. As long as no one's gonna pop up on a horse right now, we're good. Jake, if you want to take off your shirt for Natalie, that's what she would do, right? I'm not worried about him going with Heidi. I'm just worried about me having to whoop her ass for doing some stupid <laughs> because I'm not the one to be with. Take your shirt off. I'm just telling you right now, don't walk around the house with your shirt off. <laughs> do you want to take it off for Natalie? You want to show a little butt? But that's Natalie's cup of tea. That's it's enough. just, all right, good. Jacob. I'm just going to be honest, like, just be careful what you say right now. I know what Natalie likes. I know she loves her pictures, and I know she loves to see pictures of me, so I took a picture for her. You took a picture? On my horse. To frame. For us to frame at our house. Being a bad boy. And that's appropriate? That's for you. You like that, Spencer? Yeah? Your wife taking pictures? Multiple pictures? With your shirt off. I, I'm like telling you right now to take pictures of my husband with his shirt off and think that it's like, okay, it's just, it's inappropriate. Someone should be mad, it should be me. No, not no you. way. I wouldn't be entertaining Pictures like that because, girl, like you already know, I will black out in this bitch and lose my mind. The ass ain't better on the other side. You see all the pictures on the wall? And I will break their TV screen. Seriously, turn it off right now. That's what I do. Like, it's not okay. Heidi needs her ass whooped for that. I'm not from a little town in Colorado. Where I come from, I'm gonna go the in and I'm gonna beat your ass. Do you understand me? The first thing she should have said was, I did not mean to disrespect you, and I'm sorry. She just stood there and gave me that crooked ass, plastic surgery ass look on her face. Here's the deal. Don't ever do no like that again, because I will snap. You are my husband. You shouldn't even have went on that day. You know I don't trust bitches. What makes you think I trust guys? I will lose it. People keep with me. Do you understand? And I'm going to address it. I'm telling you right now, Jacob, I'm about to that little bitch up. 
Let's address it. I don't want to hear an apology from you, Spencer. Just don't with me. Like, it's just crazy. Heidi, I'm going to beat your ass. I'm really pissed. I think that Heidi should not have been entertaining this picture with my husband and his shirt off. Where I come from, you get your ass whipped for some like that. Bitch, don't try me. Left, left, straight. I'm so Okay. Straight. Why is it still okay? Left, I'm being serious. I was a straight away. Why are you saying left and right then? Because we're the avoiding beginning? the obstacles. There are no obstacles yet. It's straight. This is go, straight. Yes, go straight. Okay. Go straight. Go straight. Left. I realize that if I listen, then this is easy. We can do this all day. Whoa. Great job, Nat. Oh, Way to finish with a bang. Yeah. Natalie and Jacob. <laughs> Knew it. Knew it. The baddest bitch isn't in here to lose. I'm always here to win. What about me? You're with me, so it's fine. Oh, we're those closers. Let's go, honey. We don't have time to talk to the nobodies anymore today. Uh, Spencer and Heidi get to serve us today. Chilled soup. Okay. It has an alcohol. Well, Jacob did want Hennessy, and I did want some well, chunks. Or just bring the bottles. <laughs> you think because you're from the hills, you're too good to serve me? <laughs> I didn't supposed to for food. What happened, you two? Our lunch was lightweight, a little destroyed. The April. First hard I would have. I didn't all in it. You didn't like a Hennessy based soup. All you is how ball. much you love Hennessy. Drink Hennessy. Here's the deal. Here's the deal. Because you want to be a and you guys want to be and you don't want to do. No, you see, like true. Exactly. This is not what. No, no. Jacob, 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 handle this. See, like a bunch of two-year-olds. Stop. Spencer, you are acting like you're a kid still too. Don't throw. Not on my face. Want some organic milk? You want some organic milk? Hey, you can throw white wine. You guys are. You started. It's done then. Do you know how hard that is Man. for her hair? Like you really it's her. Different. That's not cool. They don't want to work. They want everything handed to them. You think you're better because you're from the hills. Absolutely. The last thing you finna do is throw some on my weave. But Spencer needs a reality check. Welcome to the real world, honey. This ain't the hills no more. She left this beautiful boy to fend for himself. Man, it hurts. Knowing that she had home, two other kids, and raised them. But me and my brother here, like, was it, was I too much? Makes me mad as hell now when I think about it. I was like maybe nine. And there was this time when it was his weekend, but we never knew if my dad was ever gonna come. But um, I just remember him pulling up and he was like maybe 115 pounds. He was really, really skinny and sucked in and I didn't wanna go. In that moment when your dad was pulling up to the car and you were scared to death, what would you have said? I would have protected her. Just because you couldn't trust your dad doesn't mean you can't trust Jacob. Yeah, you really need to trust Jacob because he's a good guy. I feel insulted that Aviva is sitting here lying to everybody else in space that nothing had happened to her childhood bothered her. You should take a marker and write all over her posters and say, Faye. I'm serious. Like, uh, give me a pen. Read, <laughs> shut up. And done. Come on. I'm sick of hearing Aviva not participating 100% and being, and being real in these exercises. The tell-all about Aviva's fake public stunts. Fake, bitch. <laughs> fake, fake, fake. This is unacceptable. Fake, fake, fake. You never keep it real. Like I'm keeping it so real, Natalie. You're not bad girl. There's the real oh, Aviva. No, Go no, ahead. No. OK. This Go ahead. Let's just make their lives miserable here. Aviva and Reed are starting to flatline a little bit. 
They're boring. If you keep cheating, I swear I'm gonna get one of the cupcakes and shove it up your ass, because it's really getting annoying. They half ass every single exercise. Every You're so full of <laughs> No, there's a hot dog. Dude, no, now you guys are gonna eat more. You're gonna have more. That is so full of <laughs> No. <laughs> Absolutely not. That's they do Have another bite. Time. It's really not fair because I eat less than, for example, Natalie. It's not fair. <laughs> what did she say? I eat less than Natalie. You're gonna eat all of this. You're gonna eat all of that. And you too. Get out of here. But were you hurt when I didn't eat all the food? Uh, wait, hold on. If you want to uh, start uh, a war, uh, if, 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 if you want to start a war, if you want to start a you just did. I'm far, you just did. I'm far from you a housewife, did. honey. I'm you just far did. from a housewife. Don't get up unless you don't come Her to hand me just unless you my want face. this. I'm not kidding. You just started. It doesn't matter because you, just you play too many games. You don't have to get the point. Don't come to for me quiet. unless I send for really? you. Really, honestly, you guys can't participate. We will all gladly help you pack your bags and leave. But since she's such a housewife, she can get to cleaning too. But tonight. You were all single. No, no. But please believe I run LA and I will know what the f you're doing at the club. I don't even have to be there and I'm gonna know what you're doing. So tonight I'm gonna turn up and paint the town red. Woo! Heidi is crazy in the club. She's wild and I'm thinking, oh Lord. You're talking to a grown up. This, she's grown. We come back to the house after the club and somebody needs to calm this group down because these two Barbies are about to go at it. I'm mad at you. Why? Honestly, I'm, I'm, like, I'm, are you a real friend or not? I am 150% on your team. I will go in that other room right now and call no, to the- No, you won't. No, you won't. No, you don't need to. Wait, and it's too no, late. Stop. It's too late. Uh, wait a minute. Now, Aviva, now, no, it is Aviva. too late. Aviva, come here. Wait, she's told you 55 million times, I don't like you, you're an evil, mean you person. You told me to get up and stick up for myself. I said, if Natalie, you don't like the way- you said no. that, did you tell her no, that? No, I did not tell her that. I did not tell her that. Tonight's ceremony is about the two of you. You think that she's really going to change? You don't treat him right. I know. It's a little nerve-wracking to think that I might not be getting my ring back tonight. Why should you put up with all this verbal abuse? This is a lot, a lot to think about right now. I'm trying to weigh everything out. I'm like, Nellie's good, but she's bad. She yells, she argues, she's mean. Um... Jacob and Natalie, we asked each of you a deal breaker question. Now is the time to reveal those answers. Would you give up your career for Jacob? She answered yes. Lie detector determined, deception indicated. She lied. Natalie, you asked Jacob. If I don't stop doing reality television, will you leave me? He answered no and was telling the truth. But you knew that because you couldn't leave the envelope alone. I want to see you. You still choose to do some of the things that you know upset me, but you still do them because you feel it's better for you. I feel like you're making me choose my career or our marriage. Please open your boxes. <sighs> Promise I'm gonna be a good girl for you because I love you so much and I don't wanna jeopardize what I have. I didn't marry a good girl. I married a bad girl with good ways. I can be that man that you want until death do us part. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> Congratulations. I love you. Please head inside the boot camp room and celebrate. 
Don't ever make me fight for you like that again. <laughs> Ta-da! He knew that ring better be in that box, because I came in a black dress. I had no problem being a widow today, baby. If I would have walked out of here without my ring and without Joe, burn this house down. Nobody else would have got a ceremony? No. Close to going home. Oh.